All right, guys, welcome to SEC filings. What is the SEC and what are SEC filings? This is going to be a real quick video. Uh, again, Investopedia, just come to Investopedia, type in Securities and Exchange Commission. There's a little video you can watch, explains a little bit about what it does. And you can read right here, it says U.S. Securities Exchange Commission, the SEC, is an, quote unquote, I'm putting these in quote, independent federal government regulatory agency. It's not. It's not independent, uh, responsible for protecting advanced investors. It doesn't. It doesn't pr protect investors. OK, uh, but again, this is the it, this is what is supposed to make us feel warm and fuzzy about investing into a company, maintaining fair and orderly functioning of securities, security markets like, you know, Nasdaq, uh, New York Stock Exchange and facilitating capital formation. Right. Um, so to, to, to launch an IPO, you've got to file an S1 with the uh, Securities and Exchange um, Commission with the SEC, right? It was created by Congress in 1934 as the federal regulator of the securities markets, right? Well, you know, the market's crashing. We're having uh, all this trouble. Well, we got we to gotta provide some protection. And usually what happens, and this is going to give away my political uh, bias here. You'll, you'll know what, what I think about government after this. But usually what happens is government starts out with something and what they're what they're saying they're going to do is they're going to protect you. Um, and in reality, government cannot protect you. Um, it actually just creates bigger monsters because we we give people control and the ones with money actually control the, the government. Right. So all we're doing in creating something with government is we're allowing the rich to protect themselves through government. Now, a perfect example of that is GME. Uh, they're going to make a movie about this. If it's not out by the time you're watching this, they will. But GME started squeezing all the hedge funds. GME stock went from, what, five uh, slowly, then climbed to 30, and then to, I think, 600, 500. Uh, and guess what? Well, all of the brokers started st stopped allowing you to buy. You couldn't buy. You could only sell. Well, why did they do that? <laughs> Because the little guys like you and me and the retail traders were crushing uh, certain uh, hedge funds that have money that donate to uh, big wigs like uh, Trump, Barack Obama, uh, Biden. It's not a Republican Democrat issue, guys. It never has been. It's a rich versus poor. It's, it's all it's ever been. And it's all it will ever be. They don't care if you're Republican or Democrat. They just want you to stay poor. Uh, that's how they stay rich. OK, um, now with that said, what can we use the SEC for? OK, what what good does it do? Well, it does do some good. Right. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of Enron, um, what happened with them, with Arthur Anderson. Um, but what it's supposed to do is give us a way to check the filings to see the reality of if a company is good or bad. And we do that through sec.gov. It's called Edgar. And you can look up anything you want. If I type in Tesla right here, I can go to Tesla and I can see all of their filings. I can see their 8Ks, their 10Ks, their uh, 424B5s. You know, uh, for smaller companies, you're going to see S3s. Um, you know, and we're, we'll get into what um, each one of these are. Um, just a basic overview in the next session of each uh, filing so that you can kind of figure out where to go and what to look for. Um, but you can see in here, it's all here. Now, it becomes much more important if you're playing lower float names. And let me give you an example of that. Um, if I were to put in. If you watch my low float Momo play, how to how to find morning movers and play them correctly, I'm going to show you what these people do. And the SEC doesn't give a dang about what they do. They do it all the time. Um, they sell paper. They run the stock up and then they sell paper to the investors. And you can find these companies because you'll look at them and you'll see that they've done reverse split after reverse split after reverse split. And so. All of a sudden, you'll see spike, sell off, 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 right? And then they reverse split, reverse split, reverse split. Well, all they're doing is selling paper to people and taking hard-earned money for people to fund their business. And you want to go in there and you want to look and you want to see how if they can raise. And it's called dilution, all right? So 
that's the basics of the SEC and what we can use SEC filings for. Again, I hope this doesn't politically offend anybody. I don't like either side. Um, I like human beings. I don't care if you're Republican or Democrat. I like human beings and I like protecting people, um, the average person from losing their money. Um, so any questions about the SEC and SEC filings, just let us know.